The interesting thing about the red pill community is they're the only community that allows men to suffer. So if a man today says, I am struggling, the most common thing that they hear in return is that you are privileged, you should not be struggling. So the interesting thing is that the red pill community is the only community that says, if you're struggling, yeah, you are struggling because you suck. They're the only ones that say, yes, your life is hard. Here is a way to make it better. And so I think one of the biggest problems that we see with men right now is that they have nowhere else to go where someone at least accepts the premise that your life is hard. Now, I think there's a lot of toxicity that comes out of the red pill community because I've worked with a lot of incels and red pillars and things like that. And I think that it's almost textbook, like avoidant attachment kind of theory sort of stuff. And literally every single one that I've worked with has had some kind of incredibly traumatic experience with a woman that they then generalize to women as a whole, which I think is a big mistake.